Hi, I'm Tamia Presley. Thank you for joining me today. I recently started teaching private Zoom Pilates sessions to a couple new people. And uh, obviously I've never met these people in person before. And we were a couple minutes into the session when it occurred to me that there is one very important instruction that I should have mentioned at the very beginning. So we were a couple of minutes into the session. Initially, I usually start with gathering information about my client's health, any health conditions that could interfere with the exercises or that require modifications, previous exercise history, Pilates history, goals. And then we start by um, introducing the five basic principles of Pilates through movement. This is important because this way I can be sure that the person I'm working with knows the vocabulary that I use for the sessions, especially because I cue so much based on the five biomechanical principles of Pilates. So with this person, I um, have gone through all that and we even started getting into some more strenuous exercises as it occurred to me that I should have mentioned at the very beginning that the most important instruction is to not follow the instructor if she, if I, suggest an exercise that causes pain or discomfort. If we, you know that we are triggering a previous injury or there's a sensitive area that you know should not be moved in a certain way. So if there's any discomfort, ache or pain, don't go and push through that, especially not at the beginning of our work together. After a few weeks, you know what the principles are, you know what the goal is, you know what um, those different positions require from you. And um, then you will start to also have a sense for a baseline in your body and know what feels normal, what is normal exercise related discomfort just because we are using the body a little bit more strenuously than normally throughout the day and what is pain that tells you to not go there because you'll be uncomfortable for a couple of days after the session we don't want that so the most important guideline if we work together on zoom or in person for that matter although there's much less of that today these days um, is that you always let me know if we do anything that is uncomfortable, painful, there is a pinch, there is a funny sensation that you just don't know how to understand. Thank you for your attention. I hope that this information is helpful. I look forward to seeing you the next time or online in a private session. Bye bye.